So what if I could show you how to earn $1,000? As you can see, there's $1,000 right there, and there's another $1,000. Just to click on earn $1,000 on autopilot, and I'm gonna share with you this particular website where you can make this type of money. Now, all you have to do is just follow the method that I'm gonna share with you in this video, and you can be able to start making this type of money. $1,000 on autopilot using this particular website. So I'm gonna introduce you the name of the website, and that way you can go over there and you can get everything set up. Now, most times I talk about this in the videos and people get so excited as as soon as I tell them what's the name of the video, they, 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 they stop watching my video and they go straight to the website without the steps. And if you miss out one of these steps, of course, you're not gonna be able to make this type of money if you don't do it properly. So I'm gonna walk you through the entire method. So make sure you keep watching this video. If this is your first time here to my YouTube channel, make sure you like, subscribe, become a part of the family. Let me know in the comments down below where you're watching this video from. So every time I create a brand new video, you're gonna be the first one to know. So let's get started. Let's jump right into the video because there's gonna be a lot of information to be covered. So make sure you got a pen and a paper. Now the website that I'm talking about, this website is called Zazzle.com. So go over to Z-A-Z-Z-L-E.com. So write that down in a piece of paper right now. So once you go to Zazzle.com, over here at Zazzle, Zazzle is a website that you can create lots of different designs. There's weddings, there's bridal uh, shower gifts, there's birthdays, there's quinceanera. If you don't know what quinceanera is, this is every time when, you know, in the Latin community, uh, someone turns 15 or 16, they have a huge celebration. So on this particular website, you can do a lot of personalized stuff. And just like Bubble, um, just like Red Bubble, just like Teesprings and all that. But this particular website is so awesome. And I'm going to show you how to set everything up. So just keep watching. So the first thing that you're going to do is step number one. Once you head on over to the website, you're going to go right here and you're going to click on where it says create. Now, when you cl click on the create tab, you'll see a lot of different um, things that you can do. You can do clothing, you can do crafts, you can do sports, electronics, babies and kids, accessories and all that. Now, I want to share with you how many people are actually visiting this particular website on a month-to-month -month basis. So I, I go over to this website that is called SimilarWeb, and you can use this website for any, you can, you can use this particular tool for any website that you want to know, okay, if I'm going to promote this product or this service or this particular website, I want to know how many visitors are coming to this particular website. So you want to go to SimilarWeb.com. And when you go to SimilarWeb.com, just copy the, the URL, the website name, and all you got to do is just put it right here and just click search. Now, as you can see, there is Zazzle Australia, there is Zazzle Brazil, and there is also Zazzle in the US. <coughs> Excuse me. And also in the UK. So if you click on search, once you click on search, what this is going to do, it's going to populate everything and it's going to give you a report. Now, they're going to give you a report on everything. Now, because we're using the free version of this, it's not going to give you everything in detail. So, so far, this website is ranked in the, in the world, 3,220. In, in the U.S., 781. And in the e-commerce, that's 20. So that's really, really big in the e-commerce space. So how many people are visiting this particular website? Over 16 million people per month is going to this website. Now, why I wanted to share, you, share with you, because in the U.S., there's over 82% of those 16 million people or from the US. There's Dominican Republic. As you can see, there's a huge spike right here. There's Canada, uh, UK, and of course, India. And if you scroll down and you want to dig a little bit more, you can see where the traffic source is. As people are searching, there's direct message and all that. So make sure you come on this website and you do all that research. So that is, you know, first of all, you want to do that. So after you do all the research, we want to go on to create. So you click on create. And I normally like to go with anything that is very hot and you can go with something that, you know, people are going to buy. Well, of course, people buy T-shirts. But what about coffee mugs, right? What about the mugs? 
What about the pillows? What about the magnets? Now, the niche that I'm going to tap into, I would say we're going to go with pillows. And the reason why I'm going to go with pillows is because you can create customized pillows. Someone just have a baby, they can put their baby on the pillows, right? As a gift. You have a dog, you have a cat, you can put it on there. Someone passed away, you can create a pillow and you can do that. So, as you can see, these pillows are going, they're selling for $32. And over here, there's like $38. Now, if you create an account, by once you create a, a, an account, just open up an account. And then here, you're going to see we're going to create our own. Once you click on create your own, right, you have the front and of course you have the back. Now, <laughs> let's say you want to put an image on this. Let's say we're going to go into the dog niche, right? When we go into the dog niche, you can go to google.com and you can find royalty free dog pictures. So you don't want to make sure that you get any copyright infringement and all that. Every time you search for something on Google, make sure you put free copyright image. So once you do free copyright image, they're going to show you all the things that are that are copyright free. So you're never in any problem. So let's say we search for dogs and these are the dogs that pop up, right? There's a cute little dog right there. There's dogs right there. And then this dog, look at this one. This is a beautiful dog. What we're going to be doing is I'm going to download this, right? So I'm going to download this. Oh, step number two, you download it. And then once I download it, I'm going to grab it. After I grab this, this picture, I put it on, put it on my desktop. And then I'm going to head back over to Zazzle. So when I go to Zazzle, add image. Once I add the image, all right, I could just drag and drop the image right there. So look at that. See, this is the pillow. This is the preview if you look on the right hand side over here. So you could change this, you could change the size, you could change the scale, right? So if I wanna put it where the the picture of my puppy is right there, you can rotate it. If it was upside down, you could crop it. You could do a lot of things. You could change the image. And also you can even put text on it. So let's say you put it on here and then you wanna add a text on the front. So you go right here, right? You want to add add a text. So add a text on this. Let's go over here and add a text. So we could say whatever dog is named, let's say Ralph. Let's say the dog was named Ralph. And then you want to put I I love I love Ralph, all right? So you click on I love Ralph, you wanna move it, you wanna put it up there, you could change the color as well if you wanna do that. So this is what the preview looks like. Now, after you do that, that was step number two of you creating it. You don't have to just only put it on pillows, you could put it on cups, you could put it on mugs, you could put it all over the place. Once you do that, you wanna go straight up to the top where it says share. And when you want to share this on here, so you want to grab the link right here, right? So this is the link, right? Link to this is right here. And then this is for HTML. If you create a blog and you want to put it on your blog, feel free to do that, right? So after you create your account and you do this, then once you copy this, I can head on over here and you can see it. So once you do that, Someone could just say, oh, wow, this is pretty cool, right? I want to buy this particular, you know, look, look at down here. If you scroll down here, you can see all these different things that is listed. You know, someone could just add to cart and just buy it, right? You could sell it. You could create your design. You could sell it. Sell your design, edit it. You could edit the back. Make sure you publish it. Always publish it before you grab your link. And then once you do that, now we want some traffic. We need people to buy these things. As I told you before, there's already 16 million people per month visit this particular website. So if you don't want to add any more traffic, you could just create an account, do a lot of designs, get creative, think outside the box, sell it on here. So you create your design, you sell your own design, 
right? And once you sell your own design, then you're going to be making money for that. And when people do all these purchases as well, you're going to make money. Now, what if you want to get some more traffic? Now, the next thing we want to do is we want to go over to YouTube and you want to search for dogs. When you search for dogs, this is step number three going on to step number four. Click on where it says filters and you want to go to Creative Commons, right? So when you go to Creative Commons and once you scroll down, all these are Creative Commons because they want you to reuse all these different ones and always try to find the ones with a lot of millions right there's german Sh shepherd attack you know all you're doing is trying to get as much traffic you got these cute little puppies these cute little doggies 35,000 this one right here 35,000 what i'll do is i'll just click on this video and then once i click on the video i'm just going to copy this link so when i copy this link this is where you go into step number four so step number four I'll go to Google, and then once I go to Google, I'm going to type in, you know, YouTube Converter to MP4. So you could search that up, and there's always free tools. I copy and paste the link, and then I click on Download. As you can see, it's, it's, it, it just pops up for a little bit. I could just click on Download here, and then once I download this video, after I do that, I'm going to then create a brand new YouTube channel. So when I create a brand new YouTube channel, I'm going to upload this video on there. And then once I upload the video on my YouTube channel by clicking on here where it says upload video. Once I click on this and then I drag that video that I just downloaded and I put it on here. Once I put it up here, all I have to do is just create a thumbnail. Once I create a thumbnail and do a little bit of keyword research on there, guess what? There's going to be a lot of people going to be coming and watching my videos. And then once they watch the video, I'm going to be inserting my affiliate link and I'm going to place the link in the description. So now I'm not only getting traffic from Zazzle, but I'm also getting traffic from YouTube. So there's people from all over and that's more traffic as well. So this is how you can click and earn a thousand dollars on autopilot just using this website that is called Zazzle.com. And once you do this correctly and you follow these steps, I'm telling you right now, you could go out there and crush it. Now, don't go try it for one day and then expect that you're gonna get money right away. This is something that's gonna build up, and over time, you're gonna be able to make this type of money. So I appreciate you. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget. Like, subscribe, become a part of the family, and then make sure you check out my first link in the description. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.